Why is Greenland called Greenland when nearly 80% of it is covered in ice? And why is Iceland, known for its lush green valleys, volcanoes, and hot springs, called Iceland? It sounds like the names should be switched, but there's actually a fascinating story behind it. Back in the 9th century, Norwegian Vikings were the first to reach the island we now know as Iceland. It was winter when they arrived, and the first thing they saw was a fjord filled with icebergs, so naturally, they named it Iceland. Years later, when Iceland was already home to settlers, a Viking named Eric the Red was exiled for committing crimes. Seeking a fresh start, he sailed west in search of new land and eventually discovered a massive icy island. Realizing it would be difficult to attract settlers to such a frozen place, he came up with a clever idea. He called it Greenland, the complete opposite of Iceland, hoping the pleasant name would lure people to join him. Surprisingly, the plan worked. Many Icelanders followed Eric the Red and settled in Greenland.